Welcome back to my channel, guys. It's your girl, Coco Styles. And on this channel, we talk about beauty, fashion, and lifestyle. But in today's video, I'm gonna show you guys my top six lip glosses that are very affordable for darker skinned women that are not ashy looking on your lips. I'm just gonna jump right into it. Um, and I'm going to start with the three least expensive ones, which are the ones from NYX, NYX. I'm not sure what you guys call it. So it's these three here. Uh, the first one is, what is this? Ginger Snap, which is a little bit darker than the other two. Then I have Praline. This is Praline. And then the last one from NYX is Madeline. Okay. I'm going to try them on. But the one that I do have on my lip right now, I believe it's Morph. Morphe. But hold on. So then I have Morphe. And then I have two Dior ones. And these are awesome. So, but I don't remember which one this is. So I'm going to take it off so I can start from scratch. Uh, let's just take this off really quick. And they're not like pigmented to the point where uh, you need like a liner or anything like that. So this is why I like them. Because if you don't want to spend 50, 60 bucks on a lip gloss, then you can just buy these, honestly. So the cheapest one here, like I said, is the NYX one, the least affordable, the most affordable ones. Um, I'm going to start with the Ginger Snap one, which is this one here. And I'm looking into my mirror. On, I hope you guys can see that coming up on camera. So, and it's just a, it, it kind of comes off like a brownish color, but um. I like it. It's just something that you can just throw on every single day and not have to worry about, you know, putting on gloss that costs 50 bucks. But I think these are mm, $5, I believe. Maybe a little cheaper, honestly. So that's Ginger Snap. Uh, the next one I'm going to try on is the Praline. It's a little bit lighter than that one. Uh, so let's just take this off. Okay, and if you guys can see that. And it doesn't really give you much color, but I already have like, the center of my lips are very pink. I get it from my dad. <laughs> so this is another one, Praline, oops. And um, I like this as well. Something like I said, you can throw in. It's not as thick as the Dior, but it's still very affordable. You can get them from anywhere and you can just have a bunch of them, throw it on your lips and you're out the door. And the last one from NYX is the, what is this? Madeline, which is this one here. Let's take this off and let's do this. Okay. And this is Madeline. This is a lot lighter. Um, I'm sure you guys can see that going on my lips. But when you bring it together, if it's too light for you, oh, I think I got some. Yeah. If it's too light for you, you could always put a liner with this one, but I don't think it's that bad. I'm not sure how it looks on camera because I am looking into my mirror um, and I don't really see it pick up, but you guys may see something different. I'll see when I play it back. So that's this one. This is Madeline, like I said. So those are the three from NYX that I absolutely love. And I kind of keep these in my staple for now because they're cheap and they don't give me like any lip issues or anything like that, you know, so... um. So then the next one I'm going to try that's affordable is this one by Morphe. And this is Freebird. And Freebird kind of looks like, 
it almost compares to a mix between actually no it's this one freebird looks like madeline which also looks like the dior 721 so if you wanted the cheapest one you get the nyx and if you want to go a step up you get the morphe and then if you want to go higher you get the dior which is the 721 so i'm gonna try on the morphe now and let you guys see that Okay, let me get the rest of this off. Okay, so uh, listen, the struggle. Sorry, guys, if you guys can see down my shirt. Okay, and this is the Morphe Freebird. I love this one because it's only nine dollars. And this has a little bit, mm, a little bit better quality feel than the NYX ones. But like I said, they're very, very affordable. So you're not going to like lose out on it. But this is Freebird. I love this one too. I actually keep this one on me more often than the rest. Um... I don't know why, and the bottle's actually really cute too. I think the bottle's cute. All right, now I'm gonna try on the last two from Dior. The Dior ones are 30 bucks, and I have 721, like I said, and then I believe 629. And the 629 has a little bit of sparkles in it, a little bit, but the 721 doesn't. Um, but those feel really great on your lips. So let's just take this off. Uh, let's go with the let's go with the 721 that has least sparkles the least sparkles okay okay so this one this one feels so good guys these feel I mean you get what you pay for but I do um I recommend these um, I just wouldn't recommend wearing them every day unless you have like a slew of makeup and glosses. Um, but these are for the days you do not want to wear lipstick. You just want to just jump out, go outside um, to the store or something. And then the last one from Dior is going to be the 629. Now this, like I said, it has a little bit more sparkle in it. I wonder if you guys could actually see it on camera. Yeah, and it kind of has like sort of a mm, like a metallic color to it. I like it. Um, so that's that one. I like it a lot. But that's it, guys. Those are my six. Is it six? Yes, yeah, six favorite um glosses for darker skinned women and that are not ashy on your lips um and they're very affordable so if you like videos like this guys please comment below and if you stay to the end of this video please comment coco we see you and don't forget to hit that like comment and subscribe and i will see you guys in the next one bye